Tell me what's going on. 1247, the great one now. It's a great day to be great. Out here doing this uh, weather. This weather is weird. But, um, hey, brothers, check this out. Um, uh, vision, a standard and a purpose is, is what you need to be operating in, in 2021. A vision, a standard, and a purpose is what you need to be operating in in 2021 right you cannot wing it anymore you can't wing it we can't be out here winging it we can't we can't be out here just going with the flow wherever the wind blows this is what this is what life is going to take me no gentlemen you need to be the captain of your ship you need to be the captain of your ship you need to know where your ship is going to and things the thing is about life gentlemen things change so things can always change and you can add things and subtract things and this that and the third there's no there's no problem but you have to have a vision a standard and a purpose of why you exist because once you have these three things people places and things won't waste any more of your time and a lot of the time i'm looking at on these youtube streets and all these guys talking about all these women this these women that see the gentlemen see a lot of men complain because they haven't established these three, a vision, purpose, and a standard. See, men that, that haven't established a vision, uh, a vision, purpose, and a standard will always complain about so-called women. And these women won't do, and they won't submit, and blah, 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 blah. Well, gentlemen, if you had a vision, a purpose, and a standard, the female that you desire is, is uh, flush, first of all, you're going to flush out a lot of foolishness. Right? You're the captain of your ship. If I'm in the ship and I have a vision, a purpose, and a standard for what I'm trying to do in my life and I'm heading in the direction, there's going to be many passengers, many different females and people and this, that, and third that's going to try to jump on board. Oh, let me jump on. Nah, but boom, okay, boom. This is what boom, boom, boom. Vision, uh, purpose, uh, standard. Here you go, boom. It's like an SOP, a standard operating of, of procedures. You know, you give her that book. Boom. This is what this is what I'm doing. Boom, boom, boom. Here we go. Are you with that? Uh, give my book back. Jump on my back of my ship and keep it moving. That's what I'm saying, gentlemen. You can't listen. We, let's. We got to stop winging it. We can't wing it anymore. You cannot wing it in 2021. You have to have a purpose, a vision, and a standard. Standards. Plural. It doesn't matter what your parents think, what your community thinks. This is this is the purpose, standard, and vision for my life. And if the people that surround you is not with these three things that you establish, keep it moving. This is how you avoid foolishness. This is how you do time fully from your family. Time foolery from these females. Time foolery from these whack jobs and and these, these di all these different things that's going on in, in, in so-called world. Once you establish the purpose, vision, and the standard, gentlemen, you eliminate a lot of the, of the tomfoolery. So you won't be coming on, you won't have to keep listening to these podcasts, all these ones, oh, I just want me a rich man. Like, it doesn't matter anymore. Who cares? The female that you desire, she is she is out there. But gentlemen, she the thing is, you have to separate yourself from the from the rest of the group, from the rest of the pack. You can't be like everybody else because I'm pretty sure you guys want this this special type female, this that whatever, you know, this freaking fairy. I don't know. But some guys just got some weird imagination, but it is what it is, weird imagination. But hey, that's you want this pixie dust type female and exotic and whatever okay cool gentlemen i'm pretty sure she she probably exists somewhere on planet earth but in order to get the desires of your heart you're going to have to like i said establish a purpose a vision and, a, and some standards because the so-called universe or god or whoever you believe in if you believe in a higher power or yourself i don't know but the higher power or the universe is not going to send this magnificent female for just an average you that doesn't make sense an average you don't get the better things in life 
You have to be above average to get the above average. You know, I, I, I see these females. You know, I see these females walking around and stuff like that. But gentlemen, the thing is, a lot of times when when I see these females, I think about cars, right? So I'm I'm a I'm a I'm a uh, 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 I'm a car guy. You know, I like cars. I like tr I like trucks and. You know, there's a couple, couple, couple vehicles that, that I have an eye on, but a lot of these, like I like Lamborghini Urus with the with the Mansory kit, right? You, you, you're not gonna. The thing is, when you're driving around, you're not gonna see. Especially, I'm I'm here in the, the, the uh, DC uh, DC Maryland Virginia area, right? I don't I don't I don't think I've ever seen a Lamborghini Urus in this area. Because they're very rare, right? Especially with the Mansory kid and all that stuff. That's very, very rare. That's how you got to look at females, gentlemen, if you're going to deal with women. If you want something that's set apart, gentlemen, you're not going to find, nine times out of ten, you're not going to be, she's not going to be walking up and down the street. Those type of vehicles that I like particularly are exclusive. Would you have to be on a certain type of level to even get a type of invite or or I can't or right now um I can't walk them to the Lamborghini dealership like where I'm at right now I wouldn't I wouldn't dare walk into the Lamborghini dealership I don't have that bread like that to to uh, uh to buy that type of vehicle and that's okay but I'm building myself up to that point so hey when when it's time when I get myself to that point I can freely walk into the Lamborghini dealership and they look at me um, like an actual potential customer instead of some Joe Schmo off the street, then that's okay. But going back, I, but I made that that analogy is, is, is to compare that to women. Gentlemen, you there's, there's, there's Lamborghini type women, there's Bugatti type women out here, but these type of women are exclusive. So these women are going to be exclusive, exclusively in their family dynamic because they could probably go meet nine times out of ten in their family. You know, you could probably have to go talk to her father, and you probably gonna have to talk. You know, her family's gonna have to vet you out and all that other stuff. But that's cool because that's the type of female, that's the Lamborghini type female, female that you want. But in order to get that type of Lamborghini type woman, you have to have purpose, a standard, and a vision. That's how it works. I know I went all the way around the world, but that, I'm just, I'm just, I'm just telling you, gentlemen, to get the female that you desire. Because a lot, I hear a lot, I'm, I hear a lot of men talking about women. All these women and Keisha and all this and the weave and blah blah blah. Okay, cool. I, I hear all that, gentlemen. But to get the woman that you desire, this, this, this gem, this one in a million, whatever, gentlemen, you, you got to separate yourself from the pack. You got to establish yourself, separate yourself from the pack, so the one that you desire can actually, she can she can find you. Or you find her. Hey, one day, you know, you might be, you know, like I said, I'm driving down the street, you might see that Urus. Like, oh, snap, it goes a, uh, a Lamborghini 2020, uh, 2021 Urus with the Mansory kit? That fe those females, those those type of females, they exist. They're there. They might not be in your neighborhood, or it might not be in your uh, in your town, but they 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 around you somewhere. But you gotta establish yourself: a vision, a standard, and a purpose. Establish those three things first, gentlemen. And whatever you desire, it's gonna find you. It's gonna find you. Because for this type of Lamborghini type female to come into your life, gentlemen. First, you have to have a purpose for her even to be there. What is her purpose for her even being here in the first place? What is your vision? Because so, then you're going to have to give her a vision. You're going to have to give her something to work with, this so called Lamborghini type female. The purpose is she has to have a purpose. You have to give her the vision and you have to establish a standard for yourself. Then you give to her. Hey, baby girl, this is what, this is what I'm doing. And if she's with it, she's the so-called exotic Lamborghini, the one you want, you desire, then she's going to be with your program. If not, keep it moving. But yeah, gentlemen, you you, you got to, you 
got to establish yourself first walking around in, in this world that we live in. You can't be out here just free balling. You can't be out here freestyling. You're going to have you're going to have to have some written. You're going to have to have something that you stand on. Because when life comes and things start smacking you upside the head, then you you get all discombobulated, then you're just going to you're going to end up all over the place because you haven't established a standard, a purpose and a vision for your life. I know all you gentlemen want better and we, we all want better and we want the with the better things and we want this and we want that. Cool, gentlemen. Cool. There's nothing wrong with that. But you have to be rooted and grounded in the in the things that you uh that you want to do. And if the people around you are not with your program, gentlemen, cut, bro. Scissors, cut. You're gonna have to make some cuts. You know, daddy ain't want daddy ain't banging with you, mama ain't banging with you, brother and sister ain't banging with you, wife, girlfriend, fiance ain't banging with you. Cut, man. Make them cuts. Oh man, you crazy, bro. I don't know why you why you got them standards like that. And why you gotta do this and why you gotta do that? Because I'm I'm headed in the direction. I'm headed somewhere. I'm trying to create my own reality. If I'm trying to create something. You know, I can't. I can't be all over the place. You know, as, as I'm driving around, there's, there's buildings all over the place. You know th that for for these buildings to get put down, there has to be a um, uh, has to be a, a foundation established first. You know, I see these townhomes here. Once again, these townhomes here could have been right here in this middle of the street, right? Builder could have been like, you know what? Let's not put the, the these buildings right here. Let's put them right over here. Put them put them over there in a the ditch somewhere. I mean, this the, 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 you have to be established, gentlemen. You have to have a foundation. You have to have a foundation. Foundation. And what what uh, what uh, foundation? Uh, like I said, what what contributes to the foundation? I'm gonna say it again. It's your standards. It's the purpose. It's your purpose. And it's your vision. This is how you establish a foundation for yourself and for the people, uh, and for your life and for for the people that you're going to meet and things of that nature. But that's pretty much it, gentlemen. Just gonna run, you know, just had to just come on here a little bit, just watching some things on YouTube and and uh, and just and just trying to encourage you, gentlemen, to 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 be the greatest version of yourself. Um, stop listening to society and communities and everybody around you. Focus on what you want to do. Establish yourself first and go out into the world and straight conquer. You'd be surprised at how many people how many people join your team, how many people gonna join your uh your movement, how many people wanna wanna bang with you, how many people wanna that wanna get with you and, and to uh and to uh and to, to join your party to join your movement but you have to establish yourself first you have to establish yourself first and everything that you want to do first so you could be on solid ground you want to be on solid ground when people come to you you don't want to be shaky when when certain people come to you because then you're gonna be all over the place but anyways man that's all i had to say man a purpose standard and a vision Establish that before you go looking for anything or anyone. Peace.